Right, today we are looking at photography industry. Actually, photography is something that in different places, photography cannot be deal without, like entertainment industry, event industry, like wedding, barrier, birthday, even though technology are taking over photography, but still, photography stands a test of time, no matter the emergence of technology don't forget to subscribe to the channel as we bring you this topic photography in a backlinky thank you and god bless you enjoy the view background a nice uh, uh, shoot that we, we can even, we cannot even uh, 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 compare it with what iPhone snapped. Also, when you come to the studio, you have you see uh, so many equipment, not only the phone itself. You see a background that can uh, imagine you, you feel like ah, are you in a boy state? I thought you are you are outside the boy state, even an uh, uh, US. You know, with such background you see in the studio. I don't think someone can use his iPhone to snap pictures. We, we always like to come to the studio to make a shoot. So we are we are we are trying God is helping us. We are going to So looking at the photography industry, you know photography industry is something that one cannot do without. Even though the advancements of technology, iPhone and all Apple phone and all that, but still photography stands the test of time. What do you have to tell to our colleagues out there that are not operating in studio and people that are operating in studio as well? Yeah, actually, uh, not everybody will be in the studio, so. uh, but uh, if I may say, because having a studio is not a little task, you need supporter. If you can't get it by your own, an aspect of hustling for the money to equip a studio, you need a supporter, either from NGO or from government or from friends or well-wishers that can support you to get a studio. A studio is not a one naira stop. It's a million plus. So you got to uh, 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 get a supporter or if God help you, get it by yourself. It's nice. And when you get it, try to you upgrade it. Try to upgrade it because technology is it's running faster towards us and we are running more than it. And then when you come to our studio store, the editing, after the editing, we have one called photo books. On those photo books, we have so many shoots, we have so many designs. You see someone hanging shoes, hanging wristwatch, just to give a, a nice image and a, a different thing from what people are doing. Then when you get to uh, 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 we have so many, like we have. In the photo, we have synthetic, we have normal one, we have paper, we have uh, one of the uh, enlargement, we have sizes, so many sizes, even life size. You, have, you see uh, someone getting a life size of uh, uh, enlargement. It's so, it's so, it's so encouraging. We, we encourage people to, to come to a uh, 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 photography uh, uh, line to see what is happening there. And, uh, if there's any way you can put uh, be a help or an aspect of patronizing them, you can do it. Because it's, it's, it's quite working good. My name is Samuel. Mwang Kwong. I'm um, popularly known as Phantom Photography in Airborne State. Um, photography in Airborne State is going real cool. 
Like, he's very, very nice. Some, fo fo some photographers in the Boeing state are trying far better than people are, that are in other states. If I may say, I will really say that um, photography is going to another dimension in a very big way. It's now like a, a business where recognized in the Nigeria as a whole. It's no more those days that we used to snap chakaboom. <laughs> we snap, we print. So now, photographers have gone beyond what someone that didn't actually go to school can do. There are many um, upgradements that came into the field as of last, should I say, in a, in a one state precisely. The last five, years, five to six years, it really affected so many of us because I was once, um, a, I, like I started my own photography as of 2012 to 11, and the photography then was a very local form of it. But as of five years ago, at least we have a very big upgradement in the industry. So. Compared to now, like in, in, in uh, Boeing State now, photography is one of the business that people are featuring in, and it requires a whole lot of money for you to go for that, for such upgradements and phantom photography. Wow. This is your work. How do you feel when you are doing the work? Well, I feel very happy. I feel excited with my job. It means a lot to me, and I feel love. I would love to encourage you to visualize me on this. I see a number of people come to me. I come here and visualize me to get more of what you want. I am a chief justice. I am the chairman of the Boy State Professional Union. How long have you been in this business of photography? Well, uh, Then, okay. I think you know very well. So, we are into it. So, how is the business going now? Well, uh, I can say that uh, the Android phone affected the business. Let me say, it affected the photo business in 2014 down to today. The way we are working with because I could remember vividly that in 2007 and 2015, that the world was not going to be Those days, we are snapping. We are going to be trained. We are going to be trained. We are going to be trained. After 2015, most people will be going get Android and once they are getting. that today that I'm going to actually So what is your view as technology increases in photographic world and in other aspects you think photographers will still succeed as we usual before? Well, uh, I believe and I think that photographers will succeed based on their ideas, based on the studio. I am encouraging photographers to go back to school. Um, I'm by then, completely done. The photography business in the United States is a case of greater concerns. Well, I will not say that. Um, Bad, I want to say that it's good. But to check the balance, find out that uh, there is a lot of challenges. But you said, as far as photo is concerned, looking at the photography, is there any way the government policy has affected effectiveness of photography? Well, I would not say categorically that. Um, government policy because this is just a personal business. It's not wrong with my government. 
a business being managed by influencers. So each brand individual have influence. Influence. Meaning the total influence on the price tax. But looking at the economic situation of the country, you find that everything is on the higher on the higher rates. So it equally affects the price and the cost of the photograph or the, of the, of the photograph as or the pictures itself. So the same thing that happened to other products, that same thing that happened to photo business. You know TV, today we bring you question photographies are activities here in the Boy States. We have made the chairman of Photographers Association here in the Boy State and some of the members of the association. Looking at the effectiveness of the business and the productivity of business. This part technological know-how, this part technological emergence. We have heard from them and we believe we give you updates on the activities here in the Boy State and across the globe. The Mirror TV. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel, The Mirror TV, and hit the notification button so that you get notified anytime we upload a video.